Salam Rastafari ITV. This is Fanai, the barefoot heiress and major architect. I hear there's a dust storm coming to the Caribbean. A huge dust storm from the Sahara. How did the dust from the Sahara reach the Caribbean so quick? That means Africa is closer than they tell you. Question everything. Everything is a blasted lie. I had an auntie that worked for the airline, Air Jamaica to be specific, for many years. And right before she retired, the pilots told her, direct flight to Africa is only three and a half hours from Barbados. So why we have forgot Europe, forgot Africa? Those blasted witches. Why they send us to Italy and London and Europe? Forgot we have all your saw. Forgot Africa saw. You have a question that? Yes, my beloved. Three and a half hour flight. That's what the pilots told us. Directly from Barbados. So we should be focusing on setting up a hub in Barbados so that we have our own plane. Why are the airlines, Ethiopia Airlines, flying up in Europe? Ask yourself that. Why is Air Ghana and all these other West African airlines going, picking us up in the West, taking us up way up in Europe to sit down for hours and hours for go Africa when it's only three and a half hour direct flight from Barbados? Hmm. Is it something they don't want us to see over the sea? I currently see they are making money currency off of our ignorancy. So get with it. Question everything. This is the time of revelation. You know, see what I go on. That's where everything you learn and start relearn. Don't say it's bullshit. Bullshit is good, you know. Because at least bullshit, you can recycle it. Bull filter is good for your farm or your garden or your compost. But it's the man shit. That is what you're supposed to be worried about. That is a thing that is filthy and it cannot be recycled. And it's toxic and hurting our belly. So look it up. And let us scream and march. Go ahead, you can do that. I'll build my own. But in the meantime, how about we get some pilots and set up a hub in Barbados so that we can have direct flight to Africa. Because our indigenous people used to trade with the motherland for many years. Did you know there's a trade winds that even the dolphins follow? That our ancestors told us when they put their canoe and their boat, it took them directly to Africa. You don't even need a sail on your ship. How did them slave shippers used to travel so quickly over here? Back then, they didn't have the technology we had now. So how did slaves so-called reach over here so quickly? Because Africa is closer than they're telling you. Because the Mercator map that they teach us in school is a bunch of filth. Look it up. Question everything. Relearn, 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 reteach, reteach, reteach. Scrub your brain, scrub your brain, scrub your brain. <laughs> not, not wrong with brainwashing, see? Not, not wrong with brainwashing. If you wash your brain for come again. Come again, selector. Stop lying to the people and teach the children the truth. Africa is closer. Let us do that, a project. Let us consult some pilots that are on our side, okay? And I don't want to hear nothing the European and the colonial man say. I don't even care if he's on my side. You've been speaking with forked tongue for many years, so even if you're doing us good, be quiet right now and you can help. But you can't come on the inside and help. Let us build our own thing first. Let us regain our sense of dignity and self-reliance. His Imperial Majesty gave us the Ethiopian World Federation, our own government. It was only for people of color. Whites could not join, but they could help. You can't say that it was a racist thing. No, it wasn't. Because he said he wanted the black race to feel the exhilaration of finally building something for ourselves so that we had no excuse. And then we could integrate with the rest of the world. But if we've never gotten an opportunity to build anything for ourselves, it's not the time to integrate. It's a time to help. It's a time to support. Yes, but it's not the time to integrate on the inner circle of the black race because we are healing and we need to get ourselves together first. So now watch the face. Don't take no offense. We love all people. We say fire for all don't press her. Fire for, fire for all black and white don't press her. And no matter. All nation, kindred and tongue deserve equal rights and justice or they're going to get judgment. Remember me tell you that. So let us research and learn. How far is Africa really from us if the dust storm is coming to the Caribbean from the Sahara? <laughs> I already tell you. I give you homework for you. Put your comments below. All right? You may know some pilots below. I love your Rastafari TV. I'm only here to stir up the water. Because if you're drinking some water or some drinks in a cup and you don't realize until Sister Fanai stir it up that there are dregs and poison in it, they can throw it away. Some people say my mouth too big. Becoming like bad dog.
But when teeth come out your yard, you're going to say, Bark, bad dog, bark. What good? Love, love, love. Rastafari TV.